Hi, I'm Luke Lango, and this is Investor Place Quick Picks, where we communicate to you some of the market's best investment ideas in just five minutes. Today, we're going to be talking about a super strong technology stock named PayPal, ticker PYPL. That has been, along with the rest of the tech sector, absolutely crushed over the past few days. But the fundamentals underlying PayPal have not changed. The stock price is just lower. And it's low enough to a point where it's actually discounted relative to the company's long-term growth prospects. So what does that mean? It's time to buy the dip. Here's a deeper look. PayPal is a digital payments company, right? They have desktop payments with PayPal and they have mobile payments with Venmo. Now, because of this, they have flourished in the era of COVID-19 where everything is digital, everything is offline or online. But there's some concern out there that as a COVID-19 vaccine comes and consumer behavior normalizes, this huge tailwind for PayPal will moderate. True, but it won't disappear. Okay, we are shifting from offline to online shopping, from physical to digital payments, not because of COVID-19. COVID-19 just accelerated it. Rather, we are pivoting and doing this because online and digital is superior. It's faster, it's more cost efficient, it is far more convenient. The online channel is simply better than the offline one. So PayPal's growth trajectory, growth narrative as a go-to provider of digital payment solutions to facilitate commerce in an online dominated world, that narrative will remain robust for the next 12 months, for the next five years, for the next 10 years, forever and ever and ever, because this pivot from offline to online is not slowing. So if the fundamentals on PayPal stock are still super strong as they are, yet the stock price has dropped about 10 to 15% over the past few days, then all that really has changed about PayPal is the stock price. Right, if your favorite cereal goes on sale at the grocery store, are you gonna buy it? You should. Same with this stock. Nothing's changed about it besides the price. The fundamentals are the same, the story is the same, the growth trajectory is the same. All that's changed is the price it's listed for on the NASDAQ. Buy the dip, it's really that simple. Don't overcomplicate things. Don't make this harder than it has to be. So where can PayPal stock go from here? Well, the fundamentals say above 200, closer to 210. Now, my numbers say that assuming this digital payment tailwind continues for the foreseeable future, which it will, PayPal will net about $17.40 in earnings per share by the end of the decade. Put a 25X multiple on that, which is average for payment processor stocks, and you're talking about a $435 stock or thereabouts by 2029. Discount that back by 8.5% per year, and you get to a fair 2020 price target for PayPal stock of roughly $210. We're down at 190 today, below 190. So there's good upside in this name over the next four to six months. Well, that's all we have for this edition of Investor Place Quick Picks. I hope you liked what you saw. If you did, please subscribe, hit that notification bell, or if you like to read, come visit us over to InvestorPlace.com where we have some of the market's best analysis. Until next time, cheers and happy investing to all.